guys, welcome to another video here at Cloud Colubrids. It's a nice breezy afternoon here in South Florida, but it's starting to get really, really warm. Luckily, I'm in a little bit of shade right now, but uh, you know what? I'm a little thirsty. I need some caffeine and something to cool me down, so I'm going to go inside real quick, and I'll be right back. So I got my favorite cold brew, you know, if you need a pickup, you're going to work and you feel sluggish, just take one of these, you can have it by itself, it's perfect. You want a little cream, you want a little sugar, add it. I got my cup waiting in the freezer and this is just what I need to get this video started. You know, I was never really that good in school, especially pre-K and kindergarten. I would always be real sluggish, falling asleep in school. And you know, one day I took a sip of some of the coffee that mama was making. And uh, ever since then, she, knew, she noticed that I was just doing much, much better in school. I was more alert, my grades started going up. And uh, you know, mama would make me a cup of coffee every morning. Nice cream and sugar. And it's just part of my youth. And when I tried this, it had that same taste that just reminded me of my youth. It had that nice smooth but strong taste. Just like mama used to make. Whoa, whoa, death roll. All right, so I got my nice frosted glass. Got my coffee. just like mama used to make. So now check out this little black phase Mex Mex. This guy is gonna turn almost black and those saddles are gonna stay nice and red. This guy is starting to gain some nice size to him. We're gonna up his feeding to a larger size and that coffee is just kicking in nicely so this video is gonna be amazing. I wasn't going to do a video for sure today, I had work, I was tired, but uh, you know what, I want to get another video out for you guys and I enjoy doing this so much, so I figured we could do this together and you know I never really show this guy right here much but look how beautiful, hopefully the camera is picking up those beautiful saddles, they look like fire. This is the female. She's a little bit darker and she's really beautiful as well. I think she's gonna be darker as an adult. Sometimes these get almost jet black and keep those saddles as is. Sometimes they stay like a darker gray. And this was from John Lasseter, well, well known breeder. And these are just amazing, not many people work with these dark phase, black phase Mex Mex. Usually they have the regular types that just stay beautifully gray and red as adults, but I can't wait to see these as adults. Now I'm gonna put this girl back and we're gonna get some feedings done today. All right, I'm here with someone special, the lady of the hour. Now this is the female California King Snake black and white banded that I picked up from VMS Herps to pair with Domino, she's head albino. And I'm bringing her out for a particular reason, not only to show you how beautiful she is, but I finally named her. I had a couple of people give me suggestions and I decided to name her Beetlejuice. Yep, I'm sorry if I scared you. But her name's Beetlejuice. If you guys know about Beetlejuice, he has that black and white, I don't know, is it a pin band outfit he wears? It just reminds me of this girl a lot. Look how amazing she is. Nice and clean white, beautiful blacks. Now Beetlejuice could be like a name for either or, so you know, it could be a male's name, but I think it could be a female's name too. So Domino and Beetlejuice. 
So those pinkies are warming up right now. I'm gonna put her back in her bin because we're gonna be feeding her momentarily. I want her to be nice and relaxed. Let me go put her back. Boom. All right, so warming these pinkies, I just put them in here and I fill it up with the warmest water that my faucet will give. It's usually just a little bit warmer than warm, not hot, hot. If it's too hot, don't do that. You don't wanna cook it. I drain it after about 10 to 15 minutes. These are small pinkies, so I say 10 minutes is more than enough. Drain them, then I put a little paper towel down and put them back in. And I like to give them a little toss. Nice little toss. You ever go to the restaurant and you see them in the back? They got the wok or the pan and they're sauteing and they're, the food's jumping. It's just, it makes it seem like it's gonna taste so much better. Now we're not cooking these or sauteing them, but we got the snakes waiting at the dinner table and uh, they're, ready, they're getting ready to eat so they could smell those rodent scents as you toss them and toss them, the whole room permeates. So that's how I do it and uh, we're gonna start now. I got a lot of hungry snakes. Just wanted to show you how I dry and thaw out my pinkies. So I just had to show you my extreme buckskin okatee. Look how good she's looking. Remove the water bowl. So you get a nice look at her. Boom, whoa, death roll. Boom! Whoa! Check it out. This girl is glowing. Now for the beautiful black face, Max Max. Got it. Now my blizzards hit really fast, usually. This one looks like it might be shedding soon. Boom, got it. But always hungry, always really hungry. And now let's take... Now that was the female, now this is the male. Boom! That one has a little bit more yellow in its throat. So I'm gonna show you guys how quick I could feed these snakes. I got my rodents right above the bin and I just open and feed. Now this guy's usually shy. He doesn't wanna eat on camera or even off tongue. So I'll just put it in and he'll eat it. Now when you have a rack with lidless bins like this, it goes so much quicker than if you have bins with lids on them. Look, this girl's greeting me. Boom, whoa, mama. And she is just ready to go. The scent is in the air and she was ready to go, all right? Check out this beautiful girl right here. She's coming for this pinky. She's hungry. Whoa, she got it. Beautiful little ink drop female. Now we're going quick. We're going quick. Who's next? Another ink drop female. This one was from Snakes at Sunset. And she's coming for it. Whoa, she's coming fast. She's coming fast. Whoa. Whoa, where's she going? Ooh, everywhere. Whoa, she got it. So now I'm recording, so I'm going a lot slower for the camera. And this is Domino back there, but you know, I could go a lot faster than this if I wasn't on camera. And here comes Domino, here comes Domino. He smells it, woo, got it. All right, up next, up next, Beetlejuice. So up next is Beetlejuice, and whoa, whoa, ambush. That's like 
something an anaconda would do. She came out of nowhere. Let her relax. And now, now these two eat larger pinkies, so I'm not feeding them right now. I'll feed them next. Let's check up on my scaleless annery, het palmetto. See if he's hungry. And let's see, he's coming for it. Boom, whoa, whoa, death roll. Look at the death roll, making sure the job is done and the pinky is killed, even though it's already killed. Good job, good job. And this is my shatter. I got my two red zeppelins here. Now watch how I do this. Now these guys getting better with every shed. I got two pinkies here. So this is for this female. Boom, got it. Now she's good. Look how quick we can do this. Go to the next one. And move that paper towel roll a little bit. Whoa, look at that sneak attack. Sneak attack, and that one's done. So now I wanna try something here. I got my yellow line, Nelson's. I got both bins open. And let's see how this works. Let's see how fast we can do it. Got it. And then we just go off to the next one. Whoa, got it. All right, quick, quick, quick. All right guys, that was just the starter. Now we got the main course coming. I got a couple more snakes I'm gonna feed on camera for you guys. Making sure these pinkies are nice and dry. All right. So we're gonna start off here with Zelda. Beautiful honey corn snake. Now I got Zelda from Walter Smith, one of the best corn snake breeders around and uh, he is not really breeding much anymore I'm not sure if he retired or he's just taking a break nonetheless I'm very happy that I acquired this girl and a few others from Walter Smith still looking really good and these are gonna get real yellow as adults all right guys so I got a couple more snakes to feed chaos Apollo, a couple others, but I'm gonna just relax, finish feeding them. I can't get everyone in one video. I'm also gonna feed this guy, my male gray banded king snake, and we're probably gonna breed these next year for the first time. Look at those colors, looking just amazing. So now I'm gonna go finish up the night, finish up my feedings, have a nice dinner and relax. Hope you guys are enjoying the videos. And if you want to help support the channel and promote the videos, feel free to subscribe. And remember, it's your choice. With that, I'll catch you guys in the next one. And be safe. Open. Oh, shit. Don't worry about that. I got my nice little slurry on the bottom of brown sugar and cream. Tilt the glass like that. And this is all you need to fulfill your caffeine addiction yeah so if you guys do YouTube videos and you're feeling a little a little sluggish have one of these it'll perk you right up if you really want to up the ante put a little shot of espresso in there and it'll do the job it's your choice my buckskin okatees whoa oh my goodness 